Sometimes when you apply a gradient fill in QGIS, you'll see the words object and viewport. And it's not always obvious what this does. So let's take a look. I've got some US states here. I'll double click on the layer and I'm gonna to go to symbology and I'll click simple fill and then I'll change the symbol layer type to gradient fill. And let's choose the default, it's a bit ugly, but that's fine, I'll click apply. And what we see is we get a gradient applied to each individual state or each individual object. That's why in the coordinate mode section, it says object. If we change it to viewport, see what happens. So I've chosen viewport, I click apply. Now the gradient is applied to the whole shape. It's more easy to see if I just change the color of the gradient. Okay, so we see it's lighter in the north and darker red in the south. I'll change the color one more time. Let's make it blue in the northern states. Click OK and apply. So that's how you can make this apply across a whole shape. If you want it to be applied in individual objects, you can choose object mode and then click apply. There's some other things you can experiment with and have a look at like spread and the gradient types. But the key thing here is object mode versus viewport mode. I'll click apply and what I'll do is I'll add an intermediate color into the gradient by double clicking below the gradient color, adding a new point, changing the relative position to 50 to stick it right in the middle. And let's make this kind of white. Click OK, click Apply. And there we get our gradient applied to the whole shape. Hopefully you find that useful in your own work.